Hello, ladies and gentlemen. Yes, Zeke here again today to bring you another episode of I Keep Forgetting to Drink My Coffee. Two episode trend. I've finally taken a sip of my coffee. I have not done that yet. So I'm going to be playing as Eden here. I have three Eden tokens at present, and I think it's about time we use one. So I have the paper clip, which occasionally allows me to unlock doors without using a lock. And I have the pact, or is that the deal from below? I can't actually tell on this tiny little screen. It doesn't look like I have the pact. What are my stats at? I have um, a fair amount of fire rate, I have very, very low damage, and I'm in the cellar. You know, I'll see when something drops on the ground. If two of it drop, then I have the deal from below. I hope I don't have missing page two, because that seems like a real bad start, if you ask me. Nothing dropped yet. I do have Bob's Rotten Head, so I can bomb things at times. And I only start with two spirit hearts. All in all, this is maybe not my favorite ever start. But, you know, that was kind of nice. Spider Butt may actually be better than Bob's Head. I don't really know. I haven't used it yet for anything. So, let's just assume that it is and take it with us. Bob's Head has a three-room charge. You know, Bob's Head is definitely more useful now that I think about it. If only because you can um, find secret rooms with it. And I could use some secret rooms to maybe get into some boss rooms. Let's uh, kill these fires, try to get a bit of money out of them. Again, this is a really bad start, and I think I desperately need to actually have damage available for me. I'm in the cellar to start, too, which is not the ideal start for somebody who only has two spirit hearts. Th things are bad. I had a good run last run, though, so I'm in a over an overall positive mood. I feel like I can maybe take this run on. Of course, it all depends on the items you get and the luck you have and if I can get any goddamn drops at all. So I do indeed have the deal from below, which means I'm very likely to get double boss rooms. Or more likely to get double boss rooms. Maybe not very likely. Can you guys, like, actually come down here and I can deal with you from here? Last time I did this room, I had magnetic tears, which was very useful until, um, well, you saw the video, or hopefully you did, soy milk plus magnetic tears. Okay, the spiders are actually just pushing these turrets around, which is kind of helping me out. That guy is a bomb, so if I can kill him, it'll kind of open the area up and I'll be able to shoot decently. Oh, there we go, finally got a spider out in this area, in this place. Gonna take a lot of hits to kill, apparently, so my damage is not very high. Actually, I'd almost go as far, to, far as to say my damage is kind of shitty. But is it the real slim shitty? Probably not. Come on, get the hit. <laughs> oh my god. I can't do it, guys. <laughs> he takes so many shots. What is this? How many times have I hit this guy? Okay, there we go. Now the area is opened up. Um, clearly not doing the boss run because this is taking fucking forever. But I should be able to actually get through this room finally, which is progress. Progress of a sort. This still isn't as bad as that one run that I did while live streaming where I had like the lowest ever fire rate. I still gotta post the VOD of that. I should go give that a look-see and get it on YouTube today. Okay, two bombs as well. I have Bob's Rotten Head already ready. Let's kind of try to mess with their pathing here so I have a way out at all times. Whoop. Now I'm behind you, motherfucker. You didn't even change your direction until I was like, right there. And I'm not sure why you changed my weird accent that I decided on halfway through that sentence, but that is all right. Floor cleared out, two bombs, two keys. I guess I could use some more luck. Um, you wanna, ow, fuck you, dookie F. I call him that because we're close like that. Oh my god. My fire rate. Why is it so bad? <laughs> okay, I think what I need to do here is throw a bomb in there. And <laughs> it didn't even hit the Duke of Flies. Oh. This is gonna be a painfully long fight, guys. I'm sorry. It's out of my hands. I'm thinking maybe if I just... Focus down the Duke of Flies, I can maybe just ignore... Oh, God, I've taken two hits. 
There goes my bombs. And not one of them hit the Duke. Bob's Ron Head did, which is what did like most of the damage that you've seen so far. Get away from me. I want to get away. I want you to fly away. <laughs> no pun intended. Oh, I'm gonna die, aren't I? I'm gonna die to flies, aren't I? <laughs> Stop it, guys. He can't summon anymore. He's maxed out. <laughs> He's done. I live for now. Oh. That was maybe one of the more painful Duke of Fly kills I've ever had. Um, I'm also down to half a spirit heart, so. Run just keeps on getting better. I keep getting older and it keeps staying the same. Please give me a spirit heart. No, huh? Range upgrade. A couple more bombs. Matchstick. You know, that'll allow for more bomb drops. And two of diamonds. I'd actually prefer the lock pick. Well, I'm down to the next floor. Please be the... Okay, it's just the basement too. It's not... It's not the um, cellar again. But I'm gonna die anyways. Well, you know, I think this calls for a quick restart. The, what I have this time, I have Guppy's Paw. And I have a Tears upgrade. Not to mention I have fair amount of damage. Good. I'm gonna go with four Spirit Arts here. And to deal with the Devil for the Book of Sin? No fucking thank you. I wonder if that counts as getting um deal with the Angel Precedence right away. Okay, so um, that was not the ideal first room, and this is not the ideal second room. But you know, maybe the third room, which is going to be the item room, is going to may is going to be the thing that. <laughs> well, you know, <laughs> let's fight the boss and see what happens. I have a fair fire rate. I have th two spirit hearts. This is still a better start than last run. I have decent damage, even. So, I think that this is still very, very much doable. I considered... Just... I considered for a second out of sheer desperation just ending that run. But... I've gotta try. I can't, I can't bring myself not to at least try. Right, guys? And now I'm starting to feel like I shouldn't even try. Okay. I'm on the cellar. That's not great. I dodged those bullets. I dodged the bullet in the um, sense of the metaphor or the the expression, where it was complete luck. There, there was no skill involved in that dodging of the bullet. Oh, now I'm down to one spirit heart. There was a lot of skill involved in getting hit by that spider. Spider, though. Ow. Isaac sure has a way of um shitting on your self confidence. I gotta say, it's good at that. But you know, at least I have a decent fire rate for Duke of Flies this time. I can deal with Duke of Flies with what I currently got going. What I have currently got going. I don't want to speak with improper English grammar on the interwebs. It'll lynch me. Send the lynch brigade. Okay. So, you are very close to dead. I wish I had killed you before you'd summon that next wave of flies, but it doesn't matter. And give me something I can... Yes. All stats upgrade. I'm back up to four spirit hearts. Thank you. And not to mention I have all stats up, which means that I have more tears, more damage, and I'm on the basement. So this is kind of the same setup as last time, but like hundreds of times better. Although I gotta admit, my first floor being cam or my first item room being kamikaze didn't put, didn't leave a good taste in my mouth. Left what you might call the taste of, um... Oh, what's that boss called? I, I was gonna use the shit boss because shitlets. It, it, it left the taste of shitlets, or that's what I call chocolate smarties. Cause man, that is a bad idea. Do you guys have smarties? No, not smarties. Skittles. Of course you have Skittles. All the ads are everywhere. Um, did you ever? Did anyone ever see chocolate Skittles when those were actually a thing? Cause that was like the worst idea that Skittles has ever had. I only knew one guy who ever had them, and he had them when he was incredibly stoned, and he still thought they were shit. So that's my chocolate Skittle story, I guess. 
No, that bomb stays over there. So I've noticed something about the new troll bombs, the ones that are actually on you. You can shoot them out of the way, and that's how you kind of have to deal with them. It's a good thing to learn. What do you got for me in here? Single treasure chest? I'm actually going to take it. Um, I was hoping for more, like, an actual consumable than that, but, you know, you can't always get what you want, but in hard mode, you really have to try hard for your keys. So that's what I was doing. I was trying to get some extra keys. I didn't actually start out with a trinket this time, which sucks because the last trinket was really good. Everything other than my actual combat ability in the last run was spectacular. I always get on the right here. So the old strategy used to be to get in the middle between every wave, because that's where you were safe. The new strategy is get to the far right middle, and then you'll have a better chance at dodging the everything. Okay, that's all done. I didn't get an end game drop. Like the drawings of Isaac without his head just on the ground. It's a cool little detail. Cool deets, as as we say in Canada. It's a common Canadianism. Okay, you have to die before you charge me a second time. Yeah, that that just like that. Oh, I'm loving this damage. I'm loving this stats upgrade. I'm even loving the fact that I'm at three spirit hearts. The difference between three spirit hearts and two spirit hearts is actually, mentally speaking, staggering. Like, I feel great about what I have right now. Okay, and I'm in a very big room time. The boss is just adjacent. I'm in, actually, a room that I quite enjoy with tons of flies everywhere. And one grandfather fly, which is, of course, the fly that fire or not grandfather fly. Um, it used to be called a ball sack fly. It used to look more like ball sacks, too. A ball sack, too. By the way, with Soy Milk and Eve, those guys who turn into ooze and then you have to kill them in the ooze state are real goddamn tough at the very beginning of the game. Um, that will heal me if I break it, but I have no health, so I guess I'll just break it. And I get to fight Monstro. All right. This is pretty much the ideal draw in terms of just being hella easy. In terms of just being a helicopter. I'm a helicopter. <laughs> Actually, if you ever stood under a helicopter, under helicopter blades, it is real goddamn noisy. And sometimes you see people like having a conversation in regular voices underneath a helicopter or while a helicopter lands, and you're like, dude, that would not goddamn happen. That is the least realistic. I blew up the Satan statue or the little rock that exists behind it for some reason, and I get an extra spirit heart and to move on. All in all, that was a good floor. I, I could search for the secret room. I'm not going to. It's tricky to find on the first two floors because there aren't many um, places that it can't be. So I like to find it on future floors where, like, it can't be adjacent to this room at all. Because it's not allowed to be adjacent to a room that you can't walk to the walls. Or you can't walk to the wall that would access it, which would be these two walls, which I can't walk to. Just to clarify further in a way that makes my entire statement even more complicated. Either way, though, let's check out, like, can't be adjacent to this either. See, I'm learning a bunch of non-adjacencies to the secret room, so maybe this floor I will actually find the secret room. I I'm loving the damage here. I, I feel like I'm in a McDonald's ad. ba da da ba, -ba i am loving it. I fucking hate those ads. Oh, man, okay. So, new, new meta on the Q-Bones here. Circle strafe. Circle strafe meta all the way, just do not line up to them at all, and outrange them whenever possible. Of course, I didn't do that soon enough, so I ended up taking damage. I fucking hate these guys. They're not even, like, officially speaking, they are not hard. They are just hella annoying. <laughs> Three hits even with my current damage, huh? And of course, you're going to take, like, 12 hits because you're a champion. Oh, never mind. Four hits, even with my current damage. Oh, just let me go, man. I wish I had shielded tears so I could fire at these guys better. Pop up. Pop up. It's just like the, it's the time killer enemy. All it does is kill your goddamn time. Bad trip pill is worthless, and I wish I can drop it, and I can actually drop it by holding left control for quite a while. And I'm going to go ahead and do that because that pill is god-awful. So I realized that I could fight the boss and increase my chances of deals with the devil, but I'm running on all spirit hearts anyways. I might as well just fight the rest of the floor since I'm going to have to go this way in order to find the item room anyways. 
I'm saying anyway. I yeah, that that's pretty much what I'm trying to get. None of these guys are explodey, and I haven't found many consumables this floor. Complain, 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 complaints. Sometimes just complaints, complaints, complaints. Okay, let's get the hell out of there. These guys are actually quite a bit tougher than I initially gave them credit for here. Okay, there we go. Got them all. I <laughs> love how I say that as they all have one hit remaining. We might as well actually fight for this. It's an extra bomb. Probably very worth it. Three hits each? I think that is indeed the case. Maybe it's four. Yeah, it seems like four. I like to count out the number of hits for enemies because it kind of gives me a general indicator for how much damage I'm doing so I can predict when other enemies are going to die. If that makes any sense to you. Because often playing chicken with the enemy is the most efficient way to not take damage. Like if you're being surrounded from all sides. Let's get these guys all into like one corner. Or at least kill one of them that is not currently in the same corner as all the rest of them. There we go. Everybody's dead, I don't get another drop, and I get to carry on. Carry on my wayward son. Will this be with... Oh, okay, so this could actually be the deal with the, um, or the secret room. Wow, I was really quite lucky I didn't get hit there, actually. Come on, die! Yeah. And it is indeed. It's a golden poop. That could give me access to the shop. I have 8 cents already, and now I'm up to for 15 cents. Could have bombed all those guys in there, but I didn't feel the need to, since I was so happy about getting to 15 cents. Q-Bones. Q-Bones. My nemesis. My nemeses? I guess they'd be my nemeses, officially speaking. Can you pluralize nemesis? By definition, you'd think it would be like a singular type of word, right? You have one nemesis, you don't have like 100 nemesis. Nemesi. Nemeses. Again, I guess the pluralization would be. Or can you have several nemesis? Maybe I just have like the singular thing in my head and. Oh, I have this curse, huh? Spider butt, spider butt, get the fuck out of my goddamn face. Seriously, I really don't want you showing up as much as you are. It's kind of dickish. So the shop is up there near the boss room. I want to see what's over here though, just in case. I don't think I'm going to be breaking any land speed records here as far as actually playing the game goes. Actually, I, I doubt I will be anywhere near beating the clock as I'm probably already at like 15 minutes out of 20 minutes to beat Mum. And I like how they, you actually have to race the clock, like the clock is also going down. It's kind of fun. Although I actually do find that fighting the boss trap room if you guys have seen the last episode or if you're watching this you should have seen the last episode so no spoilers there if you're fighting the boss trap room or the boss rush room I think what do I think I don't know generally you're strong enough to fight it and the items you get are going to help boomerang I bought it because I was wondering what it was well, I had much of a choice gonna be keeping guppy's paw for now and I get Krampus, or not Krampus, the Fallen, huh? Interesting. Okay, that did that, and now I, oh, that was too bad. At least it killed both of them. What do I get? I get the nail. Um, I think I'm going to keep the nail. Yeah, I'm going to keep the nail here. I realize it has a six-room charge. I should have gone and gotten the battery. Oh, well. In all honesty, I'm not that far behind the clock at the moment. But I like the idea of being able to regenerate my own health and being able to get a damage boost for bosses. So, a decent item to keep. I realize I've now had the nail for two runs in a row. Maybe this Isaac actually works quite a bit like the other Isaac and runs kind of are bound to be similar if you play them without turning off the game. So far, it seems like that may indeed be the case. Come on, guys. Just die already. I ain't got time for this. Can't believe I, I'm... It's like my bullets are dodging this turret in the middle. Oh my god. I hate this room. I hate this enemy. <laughs> Look at how close that was. Look at how close that was. Oh shit, man. 
Do they chase you down after they see you once too? Like an asshole? Oh my god. Okay. Well, I haven't taken any damage on this room, surprisingly. I've been very close, like, a dozen times. But I managed to get out, and please don't show up again. I, <laughs> I'll fight what you consider a harder room. But I just not that room. Ten cents! That means I could maybe make my shop worthwhile again. Which would be kind of awesome. Especially if there's a secret room nearby, which, you know, I have six bombs. I'll, I'll search for the secret room. And I'll search for it before I actually go to my item room here, because the secret room may be in a position where, you know, you know what I'm saying, right? Maybe in a position where I can bomb my way into the item room. I like that these guys didn't start firing for quite a while. Thank you, Meat Boy Wannabes. Meat Boy Wallabies? I don't think that's actually a thing. Pick up one more cent, I'm at 12 total. And it doesn't look like there's going to be a bomb my way into the shop time here. Too bad. I was really hoping. What's down here? A room full of shit. Hmm. Oh my god. Get out of there. Kill it. Kill it with fire. Kill your shit with fire? I don't know. Seems kind of weird if you ask me. Normally just like flush it down the toilet or something, but if you really want to burn it, as long as you burn it like away from normal people who might have to smell it, go ahead, I guess. I, I think you can actually make charcoal out of shit. Don't quote me on that, but I think that is a real thing. Um, I've had this charge for like three rooms, haven't I? I'm gonna blow this up. Got myself two more cents. That allows me to go to the shop probably be better to go to the shop before you go oh, okay well I'm not fighting the boss right away either because well, you know better off having a nail charge now that I know where the boss is I hope there's enough rooms for me to actually get a nail charge here 16 cents and here is the bullshit the cubone bullshit why are you guys so hard for me I don't want to claim that they're hard for everybody, because that might not be the case. So that item sucks. That item, you use it, and it spends your money, and then damages all the enemies in the room a very, very small amount. That battery, on the other hand, is fucking fantastic for us, because that means one spirit heart for $5 and a damage upgrade. Not to mention, there may not be enough rooms left. You know what? I just don't want to waste my time. I'm going to fight the boss after I go to the item room here. Bottle of pills, wow, this is like an all space bar item run. Luck up! I love that that's in our rotation, man. I'm a rotation man on a steel horse I ride. I'm wanted, dead or alive. I look real sad at the moment. Okay, so this is Mega Maw, or as NL likes to call him, Mega Man. And uh, you know, I kind of agree with NL. Mega Man's a better name. Oh my god. I can't believe I fucked that bomb up. Fucked up that bomb. I think the very corner is actually safe from pretty much all his flame attacks. So you can always just hang out in the corner whenever he does a flame attack. Seems pretty broken to me, but Mega Maw is almost dead. Three more hits. I unlocked the catacombs, which apparently I had not yet unlocked. I get dog food and a deal with the devil. Okay, so that's contract with from below, but the other one is flying. I'm going to take flying, especially since there's no spirit heart debt in this. So I can just take that, and it's only going to cost me half its regular price, which seems like a pretty sweet deal to me. And then I'm actually going to explore the rest of the floor since a natty. Now, what I was actually going to say is since I have flying, and, you know, I can pick up chests, treasure, things, anything but love. Moving on. So this is basically a speed upgrade, I think, as well as as flying. I'm not entirely sure about that, but I do get a free black card here, which is kind of awesome. I th There's a lot of things gated behind flying in this game, so flying, in my opinion, is always worth it. Not to mention flying just seems less common, although that may be because there are just less flying items in the game now. And it's super easy to fight the... Um, Super Pride. Is this Super Pride? Ultra Pride? It's super easy to fight Ultra Pride when you have a flying item. 
because he can't shoot creep under you and be an asshole. Single half heart for, oh fuck. Place I've already been. Like a boss. Well, you guys just die. This guy I outrange, so he is no longer a threat. These guys cannot actually get to me. And now I kill him. Boss trap room, what's in here? Single red chest, two pills. Um, you know, probably worth it. I, like I said, I'm not actually beating any time, any records here, so I should be fine. Explosive diarrhea, huh? Do I want to use this? I think I may want to use this. Oh my god. Well, that was entirely not worth it, but, you know, I, I tried. And since when are there two of these assholes? 48 hour energy! Man, that is awesome! I wonder if those um, damage bonuses stack, because you get a damage bonus each time you use Lord of the, Lord of the, Pl Lord of the Pit. The nail is what I'm actually trying to say here. I have Lord of the Pit and it gives me flying. Two very different things. Okay, you gonna switch spots with me? Now you're gonna head to the very middle, which is exactly where you don't want peep, ideally speaking. Oh, fucking... I was hemmed in by those bullets. I had... I had no choice. Although there is a bit of a disadvantage to um, actually using the nail. The new hitboxes are actually grow and shrink. They didn't used to. You always used to have the same hitbox no matter what size you were. So, did I gain nothing there? I think I gained the grand total of dick all. Dick and all. I came in with six spirit hearts, left with six spirit hearts, so that was generally a huge waste of time. Fun, fun, fun for the entire huge waste of time. Okay, well, next floor, hopefully I find the boss rather quickly. Is there something else in here? Can I pick it up? No, okay. I, I kind of wish I could because that is a really good item. Whenever one thing drops, a perfect clone of it drops at the same time. Kind of awesome. Curse of Darkness. Well, I would turn up the um, gamma, but th the whole point of this area is that it's dark, so... Would, would that be kind of cheating, don't you think? And not to mention I already have the gamma kind of cranked. Not cranked as in the um, weird kind of good-bad action movie that came out, I don't fucking know when, at some point. But cranked as in turned way the fuck up. Let's get it. Uh, let's get the hell out of there. A couple of these guys. I will definitely be going to that curse room. You know, curse rooms are the lifeblood of a lot of good runs. And I find they actually pay out in the positive more often now, even though they their payout when it's positive isn't always the best. But let me eat my own words. Pentagram is really goddamn awesome. And a donation machine just here. Donate up to 20 cents. Okay, so the areas next to that room, it, they cannot be... None of these places that I've currently unmapped can be the secret room. Watch out for those guys. Always be cautious. Shop, don't want to go to it yet. Like What I mean is neither this nor this can be the secret room. That's what I was trying to say, because of the gap. And gaps on this side too, so just gaps all around. I gap you right round, baby, right round. Go to the next room, right round, round, round. Oh my god. Giant special... What are these guys even called? Husks, I think? Or, you know, that's the... The husk is that Duke of Flies thing that I was trying to name an episode ago. There we go, I got it. I got the names in order. I should be looking at the names more often and actually watching the credit sequence. Okay. So these things used to split apart the second you killed one of them. Now they only split apart if you actually kill the middle one. So interesting new thing. That makes a lot more sense since there's supposed to be a human centipede reference. Okay, sorry. For a second I was like, is that guitar in the game? Like there's some pretty heavy metal guitar going on in the background. Or, or somebody upstairs playing guitar while I'm working. Because that's kind of a dick move. I almost used my nail just upon entering that room. And that would not have been worth it. I hope I'm using my nail as often as I should be. I have the feeling I've missed it at least a couple times so far. And that is slightly upsetting to me. Just naturally slightly upsetting. Um, can you stop spawning flies everywhere, please? I would appreciate that. There we go. Two more grandfather flies. I killed them in one hit apiece. And time to move on. These ghost things are the bane. Well, 
a bane of my existence. There are several banes of my existence in this game so far. There are a lot of enemies I'm unhappy with, but I'm not unhappy with them because of poor design. I'm unhappy with them because I have a hard time with them. Personally. Okay, let's get the hell out of there. Get the hell out of Dodge. Grand Cherokee. Seriously, I, I don't like that vehicle. Is that a van? I think that is a van. Well, still probably better than the Ford Windstar, which my mom had for years. We called it the Ford Death Star because it was awful. I'm not sure if that's something that other people have also called that van, but man, it was like the worst. Mob Trap Room, two pills. I know there is a luck up in our rotation, which is why I keep going for these red chests in Mob Trap Rooms. A luck up at this point for me would be incredibly worth it. These guys, their AI is considerably more consistent than it used to be, so I should be um, baiting them and kiting them more often instead of actually wasting my bombs. Can you, like, see, I, gra I um, baited him over there, and then he just kind of, oh, okay, hand time. Stop, it's hand time. Can't actually see the shadows because it's so dark right now. So th there is a point to this challenge. Come on, just drop the hand. Drop the base. Oh man, these are the, these are like the big leapers who fire in crazy directions. Just still can't get used to them. I say, and then kill them both all really easily. Luck upgrade again, hopefully more drops. Speed upgrade again, hopefully more speed. Wait a second, of course more speed. And now I move on. Wow, that was actually a super easy room. <clears throat> that could have gone really badly if it, if it were different. That was a really bad sentence. Okay, so I can go over here. Can I go down here? Yes. Oh, okay, my keyboard actually froze up for a bit as I entered that room. Interesting. I think I got myself a glitch and I got myself a secret room. 10 cents, need a few more cents to actually get up to um, to my maximum. There's some groceries in the background right now, I apologize. I own Apollo's eyes, I ripped them out of his skull actually. Wait a second, I didn't do that last part, I just apologize. Um, let me go ahead and grab Spoonbender here. I really should have used the nail on the last, on the last room. But, oh my god. These guys. Remember, the nail does actually allow you to crush rocks, and I unfortunately used it right before the boss. Did I somehow miss that item room? No, I got Spoonbender. Spoonbender, I believe you can get me through. I hate this boss. God damn it, at least the homing tier should make things slightly better. Um, there we go. Got everything together here. Oh god. The bo this boss actually gives me a lot of trouble. It can use brimstone. I don't understand its patterns. Um, it can also charge you down, but you know, since this is such a large room, I can kind of charge it down at the same time. Like, I can get all the way on the other side of the screen and then just like bait it into chasing me, especially since I have high speed at the moment. Okay, that's kind of an awesome strat. Whoa, guys, that was a tiny bit faster than even I expected, and I knew you were going to do that. So that is size down and speed up, and I don't get to deal with the devil, so um, one second, guys. So have you ever had a movie with continuity errors? No. Because suddenly, um, Vanazma's here, Despic's here, uh... We're all here, we're all ready to party! Oh, I have two the, the hearts. They just lost all the footage introducing me, and they're like, oh, we can't refilm it, so... So, yeah, now you have, like, continuity er errors, and <laughs> Despic is a fucking fairy baby, and things I... are... <laughs> <laughs> Don't call me that! That's not very nice at all! We prefer the term homosexual flying-winged fetus babies. Yeah, see? Seriously, there's there's an acronym for it. Goddamn, I'm gonna figure it out. Oh Ooh. my god, quad shot! Now we both have quad shot and homing tears and... Um, I'm gonna... We're it's gonna, gonna be fun. We're gonna lose. What? Why? <laughs> oh, what we both have what purpose makes us lose? We both have flying, too. My god, this is actually kind of really The babies awesome. always fly. Yeah, but I have flying. Maybe we won't just, like, all die a thousand deaths. Don't get shot by the fires. I know those fires are mean. I know, but I don't... Last time oh I, god, the jumping spiders! Last time I played co-op, it was with Benazma, and he was real bad. Uh, Terrible. he can't be worse than me. Oh, yes, he can. He can't be worse than me! He would have already died twice. I suck at all forms of games, okay? Uh, yeah. What, but fighting games! Yeah, and I suck at those, too. Yeah, says the guy who went to a championship. Tournament. 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 Yeah, Tournament. Yeah, I, I lost. Ah! 
Oh. Well, yeah, but, you know... Hover over the rocks, dude. Uh, Over the rocks! I don't need to go over no rocks. No conga liners are gonna scare me. <laughs> so, um... I'm just gonna drain all your hearts. <laughs> Clearly. I... That's my job. Fortunately, I also have the nail. Oh! Yeah. Well, Mr. Fancy Pants. Mr. Doughty Mufasa. Doughty Mufasa. Da damn teratomas! I can't see it. The problem is, we also have the Curse of Darkness here, which is just making it really confusing with the black floor and the spiders. Yeah, we we move pretty oh, fast man. too. What do you have against black floors? Um, Are you you're like Brainiac baby now? Well, it doesn't seem to make a difference. What the hell kind of baby I am? Um, only some babies have special abilities. The rest. Oh of god! Are you fucking kidding? <laughs> just fucking nuked me. Hang on, I got another heart. <laughs> Not Pikachu. Oh, that's yeah! Fucking ador I had no idea that was even a thing. I didn't either. Please drop out here. Please just drop out. Well, I dropped out the... <laughs> Can I drop back in? <laughs> uh, you want to lose another heart? Just not for this room. Okay, now drop back no, in. No, you can, you can do whatever you need to do for the next little while until you get more hearts, and then I won't feel bad for sabotaging your run. Oh, don't worry. I was quite aware that this run was going to be sabotaged to shit. Why, because I'm here or other reasons? Okay, this is... Despic has not played much Isaac. Is this, like, all the Isaac you've played right here? No, much? I've played it... I've beat Mom once using the Bible. Okay, yeah, he beat Mom once using the Bible. Yeah, I just, than me. I just dropped him into the middle of Necropolis on a new Isaac game that he has not played with very little health. Yeah, so if you guys don't like how I play, um, go fuck yourselves. Yeah, pretty much. I'm... <laughs> Well, yeah, but seriously, it's you know, it's it's okay. You know, it's not it's not all about how good you are at the Isaac. It's what you do with it that counts. It's what you do with the how good you are at Isaac. Yes. Don't oh. act like that need to make sense because it didn't. Okay. I where, say what I want. When where I want. am I? What's going on? Oh. Go and fight the boss. So basically, the reason you're getting this like confusing as fuck episode is because like in the middle of recording the episode. Despic needed to make supper. You know, fair enough. It happens. It's my kitchen too, bitch! And then we decided to just hang out for a little while and talk. And then we were about to start, but then Banasma showed up. So, so here we are. <laughs> he brought cookies <laughs> and, he and brought, pop. He brought cookies, pop, and... His lovely face. His scathing sarcasm. It's true. Um, is this Red Mom? Yes, it is. Okay. So do you do you want help, or are no, you good? No, are no. you good, do, bro? Do, do not fucking help me with Red Mom. Why not? Maybe with Method Mom. Method Mom. <laughs> Best Mom, okay. as far as I'm concerned. Um, I wonder if that's what Method Man calls his mom. Method, method Mom. mom. <laughs> That'd be awesome. And I am making an L NL joke there that I don't really understand because I did not know that Method Man had a partner called Red, Red Man. Man. Yeah. You didn't know that? I don't know. What the hell, man? I don't know dick all about the Wu-Tang Clan. Method Man, and Wu uh, method Man and Red Man are like two separate entities. Not, they don't just belong to the Wu Tang Clan. Fuck it, I don't care. They kind of do. Wow, that's rude. Can I steal one of your hearts yet? Yeah. Okay. Ah, I'm evil. Whoa. Do you have wow. special shots? No. Just no. I'm just, shots. I'm just in intimidating. Sometimes These special shots even exist. Yeah. Remember, you had a homing baby when I didn't have homing tears at one point, I don't and then you died either. instantly. Well, that's well, a great story. Gee, Holy that, that, fuck. That's convenient, isn't it? I, I, I just uh -huh. so happened to have special tears when I died instantly. You died instantly every time you played. Well, that's that's not very nice. <laughs> it's that, probably true. That's entirely true. Well, what's wrong with that? I was you supposed know. to do, pretend that that wasn't the case and that he was like the greatest co-op partner of all time? Uh, no, I'm the I greatest co-op par partner of all time. You've you've played Mario with hey, me. Hey, you see the... You, see you the, know what that's you all see, about. You see, oh. I was distracted by trying to tell you what to do, so I didn't see. Do I'm, I'm not dead. I know what I'm doing, sort of. Well, well if you had hung out, if you had hung out over the gap instead of over the rocks, you could have actually shot at them. Well, you know what? As far as I'm concerned, you just do what you're gonna do, and I'm gonna do what I'm gonna do, and it's all gonna you, you work know, out. You and me, baby, ain't nothing but mammals. So let's do it like they do on the Discovery Channel. Uh, that's why my you, favorite you... type of fucking. Hey, I killed him. Chill out. Discovery Channel fucking? Yes, it is the best type. It's the rawest of the raw. It's the best around. No one's ever gonna fuck around. I just round, rhymed around with around. People clearly are. That's true. We're <laughs> curly out. Oh, to go! <laughs> <laughs> what a bomb. What a dick. I, you know, I could have... to you. I almost pushed that directly into Despic. Yeah, you could have killed me, but I was, I was ever vigilant. 
Where am I? Fuck. <laughs> yes, ever vigilant indeed. I am always ever vigilant. <laughs> ever vigilant. Where am I? <laughs> Hang out over the gap, man. Gap. Nah, come on. He doesn't scare me. He can. Yeah, I can take him. Gapping it up. Gapping it up. Okay, these guys. Oh, are... oh god! No. You're towing me along. Spawn out, spawn out, dude. Seriously. Yeah, okay. Big rooms. It's never fun. Well, okay, big rooms you can stay in if it isn't a big room that you have to st circle strafe constantly. Hey, look, if I had died, it wouldn't have mattered anyway. Okay, I'll well, take, take a fucking half heart. No, I don't wanna. I, I, I will, but I'll do it grudgingly. Okay, fine. Yeah. Oh, Deal. Man. I'll, I'll be so surprised if we fucking beat Mom's heart like this. Uh, probably not. Oh. Well, that guy was just rude. He is a bit rude. But I'm, I'm just going to go ahead and admit. What are you talking about? He's the nicest guy ever. Well, you know, it's with his three eyes and his wings and his horns. Yeah, so, sure so, he's a nice so guy. So, talking like real, real strategy talk here. Real talk? Real is talk. This re is this girl talk? Girl talk, 64. Okay. 64 That's a thing. big girl talk. Girl, girl talk, 69? Girl talk's the best type of girl talk. Yeah, it's my favorite phone number. Um, okay, basically, I have to get a charge. Oh, God. Is there anything I haven't There was, like, yet? a 24-hour energy kicking yeah, around. I know, but I have to get a charge so I can get the 24-hour energy so I can get two spirit hearts instead of just one. Optimize, nice. man. Get good. No, oh, yeah, yeah, Mr. <laughs> Mr. Yeah. Optimize over here. I'll optimize you. Optimize died all the time instantly whenever he spawned. Hey, that's optimizing, because who wants to live in this nightmarish world anyway? <laughs> True. It's optimizing your life. You, know? <laughs> you get to the end of it super quick. <laughs> See? There you go. And isn't that the whole point? Uh, basically, well, life I, is I a race. I want to just get to the destination, you know, I'm that kind of guy. Life's yeah. a race. To death. <laughs> uh, wow, that is horrifying. Yeah, it's basically just a giant Harlequin baby, except it's a lot bigger, so it's a lot more detailed, so you can actually see it's like dry, cracked up skin. Yeah, the poor Harlequin babies. Apparently, Harlequin babies don't always die. That is interesting. Sometimes they live on and have really horribly red, cracked skin for life. Well, you know, it could be worse. Uh, uh, you could. I, I. I don't know how it could be it worse. It just be could much, be. It can be. It could be worse than that, but it can't be much worse. Well, you could be that deaf and blind. Yeah. You. you yes. <laughs> yes. You could. This. This poor baby just lives a terrible existence. Like, I'm. I'm not gonna say you have an easy lot in life, but there are probably people who have it worse if you're a harlequin baby. Uh. Yes. Who up? Mm -hmm. Um. What do I got here? You could have a 48. Oh man, that is awesome. Well, do it. I'm just gonna sit here and. Watch you do stuff. Forty, Jesus, man. All right. Two of them. Okay, I'm good. I'm taking some of your shit. Oh, I'm fine with that. I have so much. I have he two hearts. I have so much health. Health suddenly. Health. 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 You have a lot of health. I got you have health. A, you have All a right. pronouncing problem. We got a curse of the maze. The corn maze. I got curse of the. Oh God! I thought you were an enemy shooting at me from that side of the wall for a second. A little panicky, Yessic. A tiny bit panicky. Do I make you uncomfortable? I got the bean. The bean? Thanks. No problem. I just made us fart. Well, that's just rude. Um, Come on, key judgment. Up. Okay, fuck these guys. <laughs> just fuck them. Indeed, fuck them. Why would you even play them when you had nothing? Okay, because there's nothing else for. <laughs> I amnesia? just got amnesia. I'm teleporting. Oh, oh, oh God. <laughs> What have you done? Suddenly versus greed. Um, well, you might not want to be that close to greed ever. Greed doesn't scare me. Yeah, but th that's the problem. Greed should kind of scare you. <laughs> Why? Because it's just not a good personality trait? No, no, not in the way where um you should, like, fear greed and never want to fight him, but, you know, just to kind of stay away, man. Man, have you ever seen me do anything ever? I'm the most reckless person. Yeah, it's true. You kind of are. It's it's I very true. Oh, what the? F okay, apparently. Hey, I hush now! I You're not allowed to commentate. I teleported one room away, sure apparently. Wasn't. Oh my god, I can't believe I'm taking so much damage because of all the people here. Yeah, you gotta focus, yes. Come on, and more hustle. More. Cannot maintain focus, and I haven't been using my goddamn nail. Mm. Use it now, then. Okay. Use it now. Before I change my mind. Sorry, why, why would you want to change your should? mind? I use Hang the on, nail because he's, he's, uh, he's... it's suboptimal if you don't see the saga through and do the things you ask me to. Great, now you got him. Now you got him on the Jesus Christ superstar again. He's not gonna stop for hours. Yeah, that's okay. That's not okay. I gotta live with it. 
Yeah, it's well, terrible. that's only you. I'm, I, I don't live here. No, it can't. It can be you too. This could be your life. Wait, we could, <laughs> I don't mind living here. We, that means I can live in Calgary. We could, exactly. We could be you too. Yes, we could be the band. I'll I'll admit I don't really like you too much. You can like you too if you want, of course. I'm not Uh, saying No, actually, you can't. But, um, but just being you two would be kind of badass. They're kind of rich. Well, yeah. my understanding is is that, you know, nobody likes you two because they couldn't get that album off their fucking iPods. Yeah, fucking you two. <laughs> you two thinks everybody likes you okay, two. Okay, you two, when the first, when the internet piracy thing started out, they were one of the bands who was like, I'm really concerned about internet piracy. Six years down the line, how the fuck do I get this free you two album off my phone? <laughs> Maybe it was a good album, who knows? I would know. I don't even care at that point. Get it off my goddamn phone. You don't even have a phone. It's true, I don't. It's, it's, he doesn't use a phone, he uses the Google phone. I, I use the internet. He uses the bat phone. <laughs> Which, it's um, like a red rotary dial that sits calls, on his desk. But man, reaching you is so difficult. It's, it's true. true. <laughs> but I don't like to be easy to reach. Yeah, well, it mm. sucks for the rest of us. Yeah, <laughs> yes, it's never really much given a toss about the rest of us. Yeah, yeah. he sure has. It. Kind of an kind of an evil, egocentric personality, yeah, I'm afraid. Well, just just a tad. Yes, what has he done for me lately? I, don't I know. guess let me crash on his couch. That's, <laughs> That's not worth anything. I'm, I'm a generally nice guy, but only if I'm asked to be a nice guy. I That's... don't believe that for a second. I think you're just a generally nice guy. Oh, thank you, man. I appreciate that. Hey, no problem, bruh. You know, it's just, just a... You gotta wait, give wait, people wait, wait, wait a second. A Motherfucker, did you what? just call me a problem, bra? Yeah, you are a problem, bra. That's rude, man. I'm sorry, I don't care if you if you feel bad about that. I'm just calling a spade a spade and a problem, bra, problem, bra. Whoa. The catamon, a patamon, shut up! <laughs> okay, good. I, I, I am glad that's over, at least. I am, too, unlike this run. So I realized that there is the boss over there. I'm sorry, I'm not... The bows. We don't have enough health for you to actually be participating. Well, this is just great because I was, you know, helping so much. Well, you did more than me when we were playing co-op. Well, I don't... Which makes me think, is like, what were you doing? I, I, I died and then I went, nah. I currently have a file full of Isaac episodes that I have labeled as filler Isaac because those episodes were so nothing. I see. Oh, I did the teleporting hey, thing again. It wasn't my fault. Maybe you're lost. That's my fault they were nothing. No, it was just kind of like... Eh. It was just kind yeah, of... Yeah, that, that, that sound best describes what happened. Like, we had one person who didn't really understand the game much. We had one person who did understand the game. We had a lot of deaths. We had some commentary that didn't make sense. And Isn't that like most of your commentary... Um, no way. Commentary for Isaac is actually very salient. and I see, yeah. Isaac's been one of those kinds of games where it's just not built for multiplayer commentary. But, you know, there is multiplayer in this, so multiplayer commentary? Well, maybe. maybe like, what What do you say about this? I'm fighting a room full of shit! Um, Literally. Basically, you shitlets. just theorycraft about what you're going to do next and what could happen and why you're fighting all the shitlets. Which now. which brings me to my next point, is that not everyone's capable of theorycrafting Isaac. Wait, you don't want to theory? I just want to get brimstone and mom's knife. Man, that's, that's it. theory crafting. Theory. Yep. No, that's not theory. Can crafting. I get brimstone and mom's knife? You guys never watched a goddamn S. Uh, yeah. Sorry, uh, what? Sorry, uh, what? You want to finish your sentence like a big boy now? Uh, mummy, wow. I feel that I might actually be a big <laughs> Please boy Please don't now. say that ever oh again. I am disturbed. Yeah, that, that hurt. Sorry, we like, have. Why are we repeating this? Where are like we? I got stabbed um, in the chest. The thing is. I keep doing this thing where I teleport around everywhere. I think it's a glitch unique to my game. Maybe. And it's real fucking confusing. It's so special. Uh, you know what they should do if it's not a, if it's not actually a feature in the game and it's a glitch, they should make it an actual curse. Man, what they should do is that they <laughs> they should just press start the and take one of Yesix hearts. I haven't. You should. Oh, you're dead. I didn't even use the nail, and I Punk was all ass. distracted. You died. Wow, you're so, so good at this game. That that was that was that was that was the episode. So fuck continuity. So now we know how everything. it we know how it resolves. <laughs> See you guys next time. I won't. <laughs>